both the past and the future are really uh, don't don't really exist. The only thing that exists is the now, right now, and that we need to to make the effort to live in the now, to live right now. I often talk about uh, political freedom topics, topics, but I'd like to talk about spiritual freedom, mental freedom, a little bit um, today. Uh, there is a book called, by Eckhart Tolle called The Power of Now, and I, I cannot recommend this book enough. This book is absolutely wonderful. Um, no, I'll just sum up the book for you real quick. A lot of us live in the past. We, we think about what happened, we worry about it, um, and, and we concentrate on that. And then there are other, others of us, and could be even the same people, I, I'm guilty of both, who live in the future who say, well, things suck right now. Um, you know, maybe they'll be better in the future. And you imagine the, the brilliant, bright future, and you plan for it. But in the now, you're not really doing anything to achieve that future. Uh, in this book, The Power of Now, he makes the point that both the past and the future are really uh, don't don't really exist. The only thing that exists is the now, right now, and that we need to to make the effort to live in the now, to live right now. Um, now, this doesn't mean you shouldn't uh, learn from the past. It doesn't mean that you shouldn't plan for the future. It just means you know just just try it on for size. See whether you like it or not. Get the book. Read it. Uh, you know, I have the, a PDF of it that I can send to you if you like, but, but it's better if you buy it, probably. Um, now, I read this book several months ago, and I, it was really a revelation to me. Now, um, some people will, may object to the fact that this comes from kind of a Buddhist tradition um, of thought. Um, but, you know, I was raised Catholic. I don't have a problem with it. Uh, I still think it's very useful. This is very related to um, meditation, the whole practice of meditation, which there is a, a significant body of scientific evidence out there about how useful um, meditation is for your health and even for something as, as unexpected as gene expression. So uh, try to live more in the now is my advice. Try to be conscious, completely and utterly conscious of what you are feeling, what is going on around you, what are you thinking right now? Uh, the Buddha said, what we think we become, and this is very true. So anyway, I just want to plant that um, seed in, in your mind. The Power of Now by Eckhart Tolle. Um, and focus on the now. Get protected today at shieldmutual.com.